Hey guys, it's me, Christy Lee. It's been a few days. Um, I don't remember the last time I spoke to you. I think it was, I don't know, it was probably about this time last week. Um, I have made a couple of videos. One, I, I, it's on YouTube, but it's private because I was really, really struggling with my depression. It got really bad at a certain point last week, and after watching the video back, I almost felt like I shouldn't post it. I mean, I was just sharing what I was going through and sharing my feelings, but watching it back once I was out of it, I kind of felt strange about sharing that. I kind of felt like I was very being self-centered in that video, like thinking, like talking about, I mean, I don't know. Um, anyway, I didn't post it because a few days after I made it, I started feeling a little better. Um, but I don't know if you guys want to see it um, and hear about what I was going through, let me know and I'll release it so you could watch it. I don't know if maybe it would help anybody who, I don't know. And then I have another one that I recorded a few days later. It was mail unboxing um, and I'm still, I edit it, but I want to edit a little more and then I'll post that as soon as I get that um what's it exported or whatever it's called that always takes a little while for some reason um and then so i'm back to feeling pretty much normal thank goodness that was a really really rough week um it's hard for me to put it into words right now how it was i just know let's just put it this way i hate calling off work i hate it i hate it i hate it um and i tried to not do it but it got to a point where i had no choice. I came into work. I tried. I could not do it. So I left. Um, but that's how bad it got. So again, if you want to see that, just let me know. Otherwise, I'm not, I'm not going to upload it. Anyway, so I wanted to ask you guys, those of you who are interested in cryptocurrencies or Bitcoin, have you checked the price of Bitcoin lately? Um, I saw an article, you know, when I go onto Google, it always has suggested articles based on things that I've showed interest in or that you showed interest in or whatever. If you have the cards up or something, I don't know how it works, but I was going on Google for something and I saw the very first article that it was showing me said something about Bitcoin going up to, or they think it's going to go up to $5,000 by 2018. And it, it said something like either invest or stay away. So right away, I checked on the price of the Bitcoin, and that was three or four days ago. I want to say three days ago, and it was at $4,000 for a Bitcoin. So I took the, the remaining $10 I had in a separate bank account, my old bank account, um, and I bought some more Bitcoin. Obviously, I can't buy that much, but I bought like eight, uh, six, six or seven dollars worth. Um, it was $6 and then the, their fee, 99 cents or something like that. And then I bought a little bit more of Litecoin also. What I actually tried to do, I went, I meant to buy Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin, but I forgot to switch something and I ended up buying double Bitcoin, which is fine with me. Because today, when I looked at the price, I went into my wallet and looked at the price of Bitcoin. It is over $4,400 now. And they are saying that it is going to keep rising. You can expect it to see, I, what'd they say? $10,000 by sometime next year. I don't know if it'll get that high, but then again, when I first started really following it, it was at $1,200 and I didn't think it was going to get any higher than that. $4,400 right now. So my $9 in Bitcoin um, was up to, uh, I don't remember, 16, something like that. And then when I add them, I've got $22 in Bitcoin right now. 45 in Litecoin and like $7 in Ethereum. So I'm pretty happy with that. And I do plan to continue to buy small amounts when I can. Um, and then maybe someday in the future, I'll have a little bit of money in, in cryptocurrency. I'm pretty excited about that. So... Um, I don't know if you're into Bitcoin or if you've been thinking about getting into Bitcoin. Unfortunately, it is so much more expensive than it was when I first started talking about it. Um, but I definitely think that you guys should consider um, getting into it. Um, 
If you don't have a cryptocurrency wallet, that's you will need one of those to keep your cryptocurrency in. It's obviously a digital wallet. I use Coinbase just because it was the most simple for me to create and it's I like the um, user face. Is that is that what it's called? Um, anyway, it's just really simple and I like it. So I still have not bought any Ripple. Still trying to figure out exactly how to do that. I think I might have known at one point a few weeks ago and then I didn't do anything with it so I completely forgot about it. <clears throat> anyway, um, so yeah, that's basically what I wanted to tell you guys about if you're interested at all. I, um, they did some kind of fork. I don't understand all the terminology but I know that it forked at some point so now there's Bitcoin Cash. I don't know what that means but I know that after the fork prices went way up um, or value I should say went way up so I'm looking forward to seeing growth there um, and it, I'm just gonna update you on a few other things if you're interested I still have not received the Nicorette gum that I was supposed to be getting from the brand I think that my mail was stolen again even though I signed up for uh, UPS uh, quantum view or something like that uh, maybe they didn't send it UPS I don't know it was supposed to be here it's not um, work is going okay. I have this Saturday and Tuesday off as long as no one calls out and I don't have to come in. Um, my anxiety level today is fine. I don't feel anxious about going into work at all. I was really struggling with that for about a week and a half. Really struggling with that. Um, so that's okay. Anyway, I guess that's it. Not really much else to talk about. Eric and I have gone on a couple dates the last couple days. Um, we got to a certain point where we were just like never, see, hardly ever seeing each other. And when we were around each other, we were just, I don't know, we, it, we were kind of stale, I guess is the way Eric put it. So we, we went on a couple dates. So we had a date night at home last night. And then last weekend we went on a little movie date. The movie got ruined because we had a big storm, knocked out all the projector screens, so we didn't even get to watch most of the movie, but it's okay. It's all right. So anyway, yeah, I guess that's everything. I don't know. It's everything on top of my mind. Oh, I did paint some rocks for TLH Rocks, and I hit a few around my job. They were found either that day or the next morning. I don't know. I've got some more. Eric and I spent an evening painting those together. Actually, here, I'll show you a few that Eric did. Um, I put two out, like I said. Here's one that was just a random quick little thing. Um, and then here are three others that he did. Mine, I still have to paint the backs of them so they're not out yet. So he did this one here, Someone Loves You, and then the TLH rocks on the back. This is like a little band-aid with love, like love can heal. I thought that was so cute. And then this one, I am having trouble letting go of. I think it's so adorable. Look at that little bear. Like I was supposed to put this out and I can't, I can't let go of it. Is it okay for me to keep one that he painted? I don't know. Anyway, so, um, I am part of that group on Facebook and I've been posting pictures and stuff like that on there and on my Instagram. If you don't follow me at Instagram at it's me, Christy Lee, I've been I, I like to go on Instagram a lot, so if you want to kind of stay up, date, up to date with me, you can follow me there. Also, I recently put Snapchat, Snapchat back on my phone. Um, you can follow me there at Christy Lee YT for YouTube. Um, so yeah, add me there and we'll snap each other, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, all right. I love you guys. I got to get ready to go in. I will see you next time. Bye.